Hello friends, this is requirement engineering. It is a process of establishing the services that the customer requires from a system and the constraints under which it operates and is developed. Friends, requirement engineering is a process of identifying what customer requires from a system and how it can be fulfilled with available resources that is manpower, time, cost, hardware and software resources, etc. Requirement can range from a high level abstract statement of a service or of a system constraint to a detailed mathematical functional specification. Here, the type of requirements are user requirements and system requirements. In the user requirements, collection of statements in natural language and some useful diagrams. Here, description of services that system provides return for customer. Second requirement is system requirements in that structured document of detailed requirements, functionalities and services provided by the system contract between client and contractor. Here, the functional and non-functional requirements. These are functional in the functional requirements. It is categorized list of functionalities and facilities provided by the system what output is generated for which input this is important second is non-functional requirements in that reliability response time system performance system security system availability portability robustness usability the metrics for specifying non-functional requirements are we can test the non-functional requirements, speed, robustness, portability, usability, and reliability. These are the metrics. Now, the initiating requirements. Steps in requirement initiation. Number one, collaborative requirements gathering. Second, quality function deployment. Third, user scenarios and for elicitation work products in that first one is that collaborative requirements gathering in that we can join team of customers and developers work together to identify the problem to suggest the solution to negotiate different approaches and to specify preliminary set of solution requirements this is first in the second quality function deployment. That means the customer needs and wants are translated into technical requirements for software. The main focus is on customer satisfaction. Here, the quality function deployment includes three types of requirements. First, normal requirements that is simply called as explicit in that clearly stated by the customer during the meeting with the customer second expected requirements that means implicit requirements in that requirements which system must be having even if customer didn't mention about them if these requirements are not present, then the system will be 
meaningless for example new slide insert in powerpoint third one is exciting requirements when certain requirements are satisfied by the software beyond customers expectations for example spell check facility in word processor here the various types of deployments conducted during software development process are function deployment in that different functionalities of the software are deployed second information deployment in that information related to these functionalities is deployed next task deployment the task associated with each function must be identified and the value analysis in the value analysis identify the priorities of requirements third one is usage scenarios during the requirement engineering overall versions for system functions and features get developed to understand how these functions and features are used by different classes of end users developers and users create a set of scenarios this set identifies the usefulness of the system to be constructed this set is normally called as use cases fourth one is initiation work products in that following work products get produced during requirement initiation a statement of feasibility study a list of various stakeholders a technical description of system environment a list of requirements and constraints for example aadhar card set of usage scenario along with operating conditions the prototype that may get developed for defining requirements in better manner these work products are then reviewed by all the people who participate in the requirements initiation thank you